Hello, good morning team. It's weekend, I'm getting ready and I'm a bit stressed to be honest because I don't have that much time. I'm stressed on a weekend, wow. It's a little bit chaotic here. The state of the bathroom is shameful. But I'm actually doing something today which I am really excited about. I got a DM on Instagram from a girl and she's a Pilates trainer and she was like, I teach a workout class tomorrow, you should come. And that's so, so cool. I was like, yeah, why not? I haven't done a workout class here in LA yet. So let's use this amazing chance and meet one of you and do a workout class. That's so cool. She was like, I did one of your workouts yesterday and I feel so sore. My legs are dying. And it's funny because she will kill me now. It's going to be revenge. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm curling my hair with the hair straightener because I usually, as you know, use my Dyson to style my hair. But it's not working here. Like, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. I feel like I need a different adapter. So I brought the Dyson from Europe. Um, and then it's not working here in the US. Freak I freaked out a tiny bit because I was like, I can't make my hair. Can't do my hair here. But these curls are also totally fine. Totally fine. I'm also a bit panicking about breakfast because my breakfast is waiting in the fridge. And I'm so hungry. And yeah, I'm just panicking because it's just waiting there. It's alone. I quickly need like help from you guys. I need a tip. How can I style my hair from the back? Like how do I know it looks good in the back as well? I'm gonna use my phone. I'm gonna make a selfie and check if it's nice. I, th I think it's fine. I mean, I'm going to work at class. Why do I even style my hair? Why? 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 Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna put on a tiny bit of makeup, just a tiny little bit. I really like LA. I really, really enjoy it here. Like, I really enjoy it here. It's my second time here. And the first time I was like, I don't like it. I don't feel safe. I hate the time difference to Germany and to Europe. But this time, it's so different. During the day, I really, really like LA. You know what I love? I love how open people are. Yes, they are also super nice and super friendly. And I know that... Also, a lot of it is just really, really fake. But I just like that people want to connect and they want to do things. And I'm I'm not introverted. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm a little bit introverted. I just really like to be at home and be by myself and do things on my own. But here, I started talking to people in cafes or they started talking to me. I didn't start, I didn't start a conversation by myself. <laughs> I'm way too shy to go over and be like, hey, you have a cute outfit. Do you want to hang out next week? No, that's not me, but you have people coming over and you start conversations and it's just really cool to connect with people and it makes me feel like, I don't know, I'm part of a community, I'm part of something and I'm just making connections and I'm networking and it's just really, really cool. And I also like the hustle vibe here, like people really here to work. It inspires me and all the creative jobs here. People are super creative. I really just like that. I like the vibe and the weather is really good. It's actually winter here right now. It's cold. I just packed summer clothes and then I realized, oops, it's a bit too cold. I think I have a product recommendation for you really quick. Benefit, bad girl, bad girl, bang. I think it's the best mascara, at least for my lashes. It's the best mascara that I have found so far. Highly recommend it. It's a good one. Okie dokie, I'm almost there. That makeup has been done now in a few minutes. That's how I like to do makeup. If it's done in a few minutes, then I'm fine. I'm just checking. Oh, here it is. My favorite lip, lip gloss. Fruity Lip Balm. That's the one that I got in Korea. Gives me like, I don't know. No? Okay, now let's get breakfast. Okay. 
Let's get breakfast. Breakfast, breakfast. Oh my god, here is my breakfast cake. I already had a little bit yesterday night. That is so weird because I meal prep, but then I wanted to try it and I actually had half of the cake, but I have to show you this. This is the cutest breakfast cake ever. It is so easy. If you want to have the recipe, let me know down in the comments and we're going to make it together next time. But it's really easy. It is really good. I came up with this recipe creation myself, which is cool. It's not that I've just followed a recipe, just mixed ingredients together and it turned out like this. <laughs> it's also February. And I told you in January that I have this monthly challenge of going on one date every single month. In January, it turned out to be a solo date. So I just went out on a date by myself. The thing is, I met someone here and he invited me to go out on a date. But after nine years of being single, I had dates, of course, in those nine years. But I don't know. I just really, really enjoy being single. I love to do my own things. I like to have my own routines. I told you I do feel lonely sometimes. But overall, I'm like a really happy single. And I don't know what the exact problem is. Why I'm scared of being in a relationship. Or why do I always have that feeling that there is something better coming? Something greater coming? Something more exciting coming? I don't know. I don't know if anyone can relate, but I'm always looking for more and always looking for something that, that feels more perfect. Maybe if the right person is coming, I don't have these thoughts and I don't have these feelings anymore. Then it's going to feel perfect. And it's not that I want to have it perfect. Like I know that perfect things just don't exist. Perfect relationships don't exist. Perfect people don't exist. Me included, I'm not perfect. I'm far away from being perfect and being on the other side, I'm like, oh my God, dating me must be so terrible because <laughs> I also have my weird things that I do and I'm also not the easiest person. Mm, but yeah, I'm really trying to find something that feels perfect and I think that's a problem. But yeah, I'm going to go and go on a date with this guy and I met him in a club here <laughs> so I went out one night as you know I'm not at all a night person I love my early mornings I love to be up at 5 a.m and do my healthy girl things but one night here we went out and it was actually really fun I said, hey, hey, what's your name, baby? it was a lot of fun I think once in a while it's okay if you are with the right people and if you get the opportunity to go out and have fun, then just do it. Don't overthink it. And it's also not ruining your process if you think like that. Of course, the next day I felt terrible. My next day had been absolutely terrible. It was not fun at all, but it was still such a fun night and I'm so happy we did it. <laughs> It's going to be upstairs, the door on your left. And then there's also like couches upstairs. Well. All right. Thank you. I'm gonna check out a lunch place now. Two years ago, I had been at this cafe. I remember it, it was close to here. And I wanna have lunch there today. It was really good. Then I can also get some work done there. And then later, don't know. Proper Australian coffee, it's really good. Mm. So quite stressful inside. Mm. Anything else that you guys want to No, that's everything now. Thank you so much. It looks good. 
Oh my god, wow. That looks yum. Look at that. Like, whoa. Mm. Wow. Wow. The pickles are also really spicy. Mmm. -hmm. I'm gonna sweat after this. Someone went all in. That's so spicy. Okay. <laughs> um, can I have one iced latte with almond milk and decaf? I might need to get some almond milk for at home iced lattes. Spontaneous decision to walk up at the Runyon Canyon, watch the sunset. But we kind of missed it. We were a bit late today. It's just mind-blowing how big LA is. It's so big. I don't know, I think it's all the way there. We're just in West Hollywood now and we don't leave the bubble. Just stay in West Hollywood. Maybe we make it to the beach next week, to Venice. Would be fun. It's crazy, crazy when I compare that to my little village that I grew up in, in Austria, like what the hell, <laughs> it's so different, it's so different, so crazy. Don't know if I could imagine living here, somehow yes, I really like it, I love the color tones of the sky, everything, everything is just so colorful, also when you walk through the streets. The walls are so colorful. I don't know, it makes me happy. It makes me feel creative. I really like it, but of course it also has some downsides, not just the bad traffic, but also lots of crime. It's getting dangerous when it's getting dark, so we better go home. That's freaking cute. Hello. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> we see. Dinner, dinner time chicken some veggies and i'm gonna add some tomato ketchup question is what are we watching netflix oh my god i love ketchup so much i think i need a bit more i always buy the sugar-free ketchup but it's still super good just need a lot it's a bit too much oh the hardest part on netflix is just finding the right the thing to watch. We need some love, drama, dating drama. To turn the head off. I feel like that's the best thing to turn the head off. Love Island? Mm-hmm. Love Island. I just know the German one. So that's gonna be so different. Essex is a continent. No, no it's a county. Oh, what, a country? A county. What's the difference county. between a county and a country? Country. So a country is like England. So yeah. I'm from Liverpool, so I live in a country. No, Liverpool's a city. A city. Yeah. Welcome to Love England Island. Do you know I this one place, series you know, where thing. they come on an island and they all are naked? That also had been a TV show in Germany. My favorite dating show in Austria is like with the farmers, where farmers are looking for finding the right partner. It's so fun. Would you ever go to a dating show? Would you ever do that? I think I couldn't. Oh my god, imagine being in a dating show. I couldn't decide today if I want to try strawberry or if I want to try vanilla, so I want to try both. It's actually not true because vanilla, I already know how it tastes, but I will have a little bit of both. Back to the basics today. I'm gonna try a little bit of strawberry first. 
ponies fresh right whistle inside a town. What the beef would take? There's something on the spoon. Hmm. Strawberry is very fresh. And I'm gonna try vanilla. Vanilla bean. Mmm. Mmm. Vanilla bean favorite. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. I just always get so cold when I eat ice cream. Today, nothing is funny. No matter what we watch, it's not funny. <laughs> so cold. Oh, they're nasty. Drunk. Actually, forgot to put on my wristbands. This is like game changer because the worst if you wash off your makeup or if you wash your face is when the water is running down on your arms. Like there is no feeling in the world that's that bad. It's just cold. It's just uh, the water shouldn't be there. But with these wristbands, the water stops here. Well, you need those. I just ordered them on Amazon and they are genius. Mm. Today was really fun. I did a lot of things. I didn't spend much time here in the apartment, but really often on the weekend, I just also spent the whole day at home. And I quickly wanted to remind you that it's absolutely okay to not go out on weekends. I hope you all don't have FOMO because also most of the time, yeah, if you think of other people and you see them partying on the weekend and you see them going out and doing things and having fun, that's just what they share with us. So people just show their highlights and they show their wild, crazy parties and it makes us feel bad sometimes and it makes us feel like we're missing out. But don't forget that most people just share their highlight reel and they just share their wild weekends. Nobody shares a relaxed weekend where they literally do nothing. I will. Next time when I also just spend the whole day at home, I will share it with you. So you know it's normal. Normal to also just do nothing. It's totally fine. It's totally okay. I um, mean, wash, wash, wash. I really always try to clean my face as good as I can. Get rid of all the makeup and the dirty, 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 dirty things from LA. I'm actually really tired and so excited for bed right now. The ice cream, like, I love ice cream so much, but I'm always freezing when I eat it. <laughs> oh my god. That was my Saturday. That's how my weekend looks like sometimes when I feel like outgoing. When I feel like I want to do things throughout the day, <laughs> then I go to work at class, have a nice meal, and then I just really love to spend time outside. Like going for a hike, it's just really, really nice and it always makes me feel, I don't know, so different. I feel so happy. I feel so happy when I'm outside and when I spend time in nature and when I see blue sky, the sun and a sunset. That makes me truly happy. So, well, I'm really tired now and also quickly want to remind you that, but yeah, I'm really, really tired now. I hope you enjoyed. Oh, oh my God. I hope you enjoyed today's day with me. I hope you got some inspiration for your own weekend. I hope you feel inspired. Did I just say I that? Say <laughs> I don't know. I'm so tired, so tired guys. But I'm also so happy that you spent a day with me and that you are here and I'm really grateful for that. Feels like we're friends, we're friends and we are hiking up Runyon Canyon together. Yeah, kind of weird, but that's how it is. That's how I feel. Thank you so, so much. I wish you could just kick me out of bed so I can give you the hug to end this video because I'm just lazy now and I don't want to leave the blanket.
So come, come and kick me out. I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm going to give you a hug and then I'm going to say bye. And then this video is done. So the video end is here then. The video end is here then. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. Hug, hug, hug. Thank you so, so much. I love you a lot. And now this is the end of the video. I'm not ending it, so you have to end it. Bye, guys. End it. You should end the video now. <laughs> if I don't end it and you don't end it, what's gonna happen then? I don't know. End it now. <laughs> then I end it. Bye. Bye. <laughs>